John, it was an intense search here last night with drones and helicopters when that teen went missing. But that search came to an end when the 19 year old's body washed ashore and he was taken to the hospital. First responders faced with the night sky as they searched for a 19 year old man who went missing after going into the ocean at Jacob Reese Park Beach at around 745 Friday night. The search conducted by the NYPD's aviation and harbor units plus divers. Witnesses say lifeguards called everyone out of the water, but many defied those orders. Basically, they was blowing the whistle, signaling to come back, and then a few minutes after everybody left, they flew right back in. They called everybody out the water. Everybody came out. Once they left off, everybody ran back in. They didn't want to finish their time on the ocean because, you know, the lifeguards went off duty. So they went back in, and that's when things got back. Don't go and stay up to your knees. You know, stay up to your knees. We see it all the time. And uh, I just wish the family of whatever's going on here, sorry. And at Coney Island, the search is still on for a 15 year old boy who went missing after going into the ocean there on Thursday. He was in the water with his 14 year old brother who was rescued and is expected to be okay. But the 15 year old has still not been found. City beaches have been suffering from a lifeguard shortage. You start recruiting in September. You have lifeguards. You don't have lifeguards? That's just baloney. And the search for that 15 year old boy at Coney Island Beach will continue. And just a reminder that swimming is only allowed at the city's public beaches between 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. when lifeguards are on duty. We're live in the Rockaways at Jacob Reese Park Beach. Michelle Ross, Pix 11 News.